guys, it's Matt Jones reporting in from Sydney on the Sydney Harbour Bridge. Just been doing my training run for today and welcome to this Project Life Bridge. In Life Bridge, I'm asking a question what can we do to alleviate child mortality? Come with me on a journey while I explore this question. The pre-sale of the book Life Bridge supports a project that began in 2010 called the 10 City Bridge Run, which has yet to take place. During the 10 City Bridge Run, I will run 10 sub-marathons, each of 24 kilometres in 10 cities across 10 countries, as a stunt to open a conversation asking, how can we use our networks to reduce child mortality? This is in the context of the United Nations Millennium Development Goals. The Millennium Development Goals seek to reduce extreme poverty by two-thirds before the year 2015. Millennium Development Goal 4 relates to child mortality. Child mortality relates to under five deaths, for which there are five leading causes, all of which are easily preventable, including pneumonia, diarrhea and malaria. We are falling short of our efforts to meet Millennium Development Goal 4 before 2015. The 10 City Bridge Run will be conducted in three legs to give more emphasis on building the conversation. Each city visited builds into a narrative that helps to improve our understanding and awareness of child mortality, including running in four of the five countries that account for 50% of under five death globally. At each location where running takes place, a design forum will be held to help understand the problem more fully and look for ways we can collaborate better to reduce child mortality. Asking the right questions matters most. Steve Lawrence was a pioneer of social innovation in Australia, who sadly died last year. Here now from one of his last public appearances, where he is talking about the need for a willingness to explore ideas and past failures. We've got to find ways out of programs like this to capture the learning so that we can share it. And, you know, I think having this kind of session is one way to do that, and I think that's really valuable, including talking about failure and what didn't work. And we haven't asked any questions about that today, but I think we should. And I think it's really important that we are open and honest enough in our conversation and that the trust is here, that the investors aren't going to go away just because not everything worked perfectly, because it didn't. I know it wouldn't have, because it never does. This project will only be possible through your support. I'm here in Seoul, just outside the workroom studios. These are the guys that are going to produce the book Life Bridge. Let's go inside and see what, see what they're up to. Right, well, we've just had a good discussion. Let's take a look at a couple of books which this Life Bridge book might look like. This is just an example, but this is what the uh, soft cover book might look like. And uh, this is pictorial, um, beautifully produced. It's a, it's a wonderful. Uh, uh, production house here, one of the best designers in, in Korea for uh, art and design books. And uh, here's, here's an example of one of their um, hardcover books. They've got hundreds of books to choose from, but this is just taken off the shelf and the quality is fantastic. Uh, so I tell you what, we can really look forward to a fantastic book coming out from LifeBridge. So please support this project. A quick message to those who have supported this project already. Thank you. Your generosity has been a tremendous encouragement for me. This is a team effort and I continue to train hard on behalf of all of us. Training tonight at Sydney Olympic Park. Uh, tonight's training is uh, four uh, mile sprints. That's four 1.6 kilometre sprints. So this is a message to say a big thank you. Uh, a, a very special thank you to everyone who's supported me in every way, in advice, in encouragement, also in money. It means a lot and uh, we've got a big journey ahead, so thanks for coming along and joining me. Please help bridge the imagination gap. I need you to back me up. I'm asking for your support. I'm here on the banks of the Han River in Seoul. This is one of the bridges that I'll be running across, but first I need your help. Together, we can start this journey at the end of March in London and finish in September around the time of the UN General Assembly in New York, after which we'll hold a global design forum to bring together all that we've learnt about reducing child mortality. The solutions are out there already. We've just got to bring them together 
and talk about them. Engage the experts, engage the stakeholders. We can make a difference. This book will be fantastic. It's going to be a, a magnificently produced book. I invite you to be part of the journey. Please support me. Thank you for your time.